And so I wonder to what degree you find in the places that you that you operate, you know, to, to what degree are cultural circumstances a factor, cultural beliefs a factor, uh, what role does that play? Well, we think culture actually weighs in very heavily. And in fact, one of the, the things that we're told um, that Endeavor does most is not give access to capital or even access to mentors. It's helping entrepreneurs to think big. So my the favorite email that I got this year was the day after the Academy Awards. And I got an email from these two Mexicans who had started this post-production animation company and had wanted to uh, set up shop in LA. And everyone told them, you are just out of your minds. And uh, one of our, the, our board members helped them um, uh, set up their, their shop. And they were telling me that they had just been part of the Oscar-winning team for Benjamin Button, the post-production, um, the special effects. And they said, thank you for helping us believe that two Mexican entrepreneurs could really think big. And the reason I say this is, um, I, you know, what's interesting to me is the changes in culture. So, for example, when we started in Chile, Chile was, I had lived there and uh, just after the Pinochet transition, it was cut off from the rest of the world. So when we started Endeavor 11 years ago, I always used to joke that the Chilean entrepreneurs would say, we are the only B2B healthcare company in the world. I said, are you, are you sure about that? Oh, yes, we've seen no other. And I said, well, we have... 45 business plans just from Latin America. Have you checked them out? Uh, today, we just saw this company, uh, Beta Zeta in Brazil, and we had him interviewed by the number three person at Amazon International. And they were going toe to toe, looking at all the, the, the top blogs, and he knew everything that was happening in, in Silicon Valley, in China, in India. And I thought, that is a difference. I mean, that in 10 years, in one decade, Chile going from being cut off to the world to being opened globally. And I think we see a lot of these other cultural myths being shattered.